hi guys so welcome to today's video in today's video I'm going to show you how to make an hydrating anti-aging facial moisturizer in this moisturizer I'm using vitamin A vitamin C and vitamin E all these amazing vitamins are great for the skin they will help to reduce wrinkles and fine lines on the skin while boosting the collagen production just plumping up the skin and get your skin to look much younger and fresher also it will help to get rid of dark spots and blemishes on the face just hydrate your face your neck and your decollete now with continuous use of this anti-aging facial cream you will notice a significant difference to your skin your skin will start to look clearer the wrinkles will start to fade and before you know it you will be looking much younger and fresher so what are you waiting for follow me to the kitchen I share the recipe with you and I will also give you some tips and how to use this amazing homemade facial cream on your skin for best result to make this recipe you're gonna need a few things and one of the most important thing is a small blender if you have a large blender the recipe the ingredients might just get lost in the blender so a small blender is preferred and our first ingredient is some shea butter we're not using a lot of shea butter run about a half an ounce or so of the shea butter since it is very very light the most is about an ounce and this amount I have here is pretty much less than a ounce just use a little piece of shea butter in this recipe now you can choose to melt the shea butter or you can leave it as is my second ingredient is some rose water and rose water is very very hydrating to the skin for this cream this will be the only water that we are using and this is what is going to help to fluff it up and make it look more like a cream line consistency if you do not have rose water for this recipe you can just use a little bit of a green tea water or even substitute it with some coffee liquid so now I'm going to use about one teaspoon of the rose water and I'm going to pour this on top of the shea butter and next I'm going to move for my next ingredient and this is a aloe vera gel for this recipe because I want it to have a longer shelf life I'm using all store-bought so I'm using the store-bought aloe vera gel wanting to make sure of when you're looking for aloe vera gel make sure that it is 100% pure natural aloe vera gel now aloe vera gel will help to hydrate the skin it will also help to clear the skin of hyperpigmentation it is also good for sunburn making this cream a perfect cream to also use in the daytime and this aloe vera gel also contains vitamin C so I'm gonna use one tablespoon of the aloe vera gel and we're pouring this in as I said before I do not suggest you use fresh aloe vera gel but if you have fresh aloe vera gel you can use it but your cream is gonna have a shorter shelf life our next ingredient is avocado oil and I'm using the avocado oil for its vitamin A properties it also contains vitamin E and avocado itself have all the electrolytes that will have to boost the collagen production in the skin reduce the wrinkles and fine lines and just leave your skin looking younger and fresher so I'm gonna use about one tablespoon of the avocado oil now if you do not have avocado oil a good substitute is some carrot seed oil now let's move on to our next ingredient which is some rosehip oil and I'm using rosehip oil as an anti-aging oil since it contain a high amount of vitamin A this vitamin A will help to reduce the wrinkles and fine lines penetrate deep into the skin and also it will help to boost the collagen production hydrates the skin especially when you have aging skin so I'm gonna use about a half of a teaspoon of the rosehip oil a good substitute for the rosehip oil is some squalene oil you can even choose to use some papaya seed oil 
or some cacao oil and all of these oil are high in vitamin A. And let's move on to another amazing anti-aging facial oil which is a sesame seed oil. Wanting to note when you're looking for sesame seed oil make sure that it is unroasted sesame seed oil. I'm using a teaspoon of the sesame seed oil. Amazing for aging skin hydrates the skin, boots collagen production, and also when mixed with the other ingredient, will have your skin looking much younger, radiant with a natural glow. Now that's it guys, now that we have all the ingredient in this, we are gonna use an optional ingredient, very optional guys, but if you have a lot of spots and blemishes on your skin, if you have like old scars and all of that on your skin, this is an amazing optional ingredient, which is turmeric powder. You do not need a lot you just need a little pinch of this and pour it in and now guys what we're gonna do we're gonna cover and we are gonna blend now if you do not have a blender for this recipe guys you can choose to melt the shea butter and use a whisk at this stage to thus whisk everything together now once we blend take a look at our anti-aging moisturizing skin brightening collagen boosting facial cream also amazing now I'm gonna store this in a small container choose a container that have a tight cover so let's look how rich this is guys this is so rich and oh so nice now once we pour this in as I said you can cover this and you can stir this in your refrigerator for up to a month as a matter of fact guys you really do not need to store this in the refrigerator you can basically leave it on the countertop if you use fresh aloe vera gel you definitely need to store it in the refrigerator and that is gonna last you about seven days and this can be used on your skin guys a.m. and p.m. to use this you want to apply it to clean skin and you can use this right above your facial toner a little Little goes a long way you don't need a lot so just apply this to your skin and this is gonna totally dissolve on your skin basically disappear on the skin and before you know it guys amazing perfect for dry skin perfect for normal skin perfect for wrinkle skin perfect for skin with dark spots and blemishes just an overall natural anti-aging facial cream that's gonna get the job done so there you have it thank you all for watching if you like the video give it a thumbs up don't forget to share and also guys click on that little bell at the side and turn on post notification on your phone so that each time i upload a video you will get a notification right away now if you have not yet subscribed do not leave without subscribing click on the word subscribe below and you will be subscribed thank you all and i'll see you in my next video